It has been nearly 20 years since JonBenet Ramsey was killed, and her murder is still unsolved. When she died, there were only three people in the Ramsey home, her parents, John and Patsy, and her nine-year-old brother, Burke. In today's Dr. Phil, her now 29-year-old brother spoke out for the first time, while her father, Ramsey, says uh, this will be the last time he speaks about his daughter's death. That's John Ramsey. CBS 4's Walter McCullough has the story. John Benet's older brother, Burke, was just nine years old. He remembers being woken up that Christmas morning in 1996. The first thing I remember is my mom first thing in my room, really frantic, saying, like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, running around my room looking for John Benet. He remained there, even an hour later, when he says a police officer came in with a flashlight. I'm not the worry type. I'm not the, I guess part of me doesn't want to know what's going on. <laughs> Critics would say you weren't curious because you already knew. He didn't have to get up and go check because he knew exactly what had happened. I was scared, I think. A three-page ransom note written on a notepad belonging to the Ramseys with one of their pens was found by Patsy Ramsey. There's a lot of suspicion around the note. If somebody is going to kidnap somebody, by the way, you bring the ransom note already written. You don't write it inside the house. I don't think I've read the whole thing. I've definitely seen pictures of it, though. The Ramsey said they had searched the entire house for their daughter. One of the officers suggested they do it again. They started in the basement. John Ramsey says he opened up one of the rooms and turned on the light. John Bonet was lying there on the floor. Did you know she was dead? No, not at that point. I mean, I had this rush of, thank God I found her. And it was just this overwhelming sense of joy that I'd found my child. And her hands were tied over her head. She had tape on her mouth. I immediately took the tape off. Burke was at a friend's house when John Bonet was found. He says his father picked him up and told him the news. My dad just said she's in heaven now. And I was kind of like, how is that possible? Like, and what did you say? I started crying. I don't think I said anything. And the three-part series is just getting started. Part two airs tomorrow at 3 p.m. right here on CBS4. Burke will address the strange and unexplained evidence that has led police to speculate that he murdered his sister, including a recording of his voice in the background of Patsy Ramsey's 911 call to police when he was supposedly still sleeping, plus the never-before-seen tapes of his interrogation with police. Walter McCullough, CBS4 News. And as Walter mentioned, you can watch the second part of the three-part series tomorrow at 3 right here on CBS4. And then on Sunday, tune in for a special CBS docu-series called The Case of Jean Benet Ramsey. Original investigators recreate the crime scene with full-scale replicas of the rooms in the Ramsey house, conduct extensive interviews, and introduce new theories. That's at Sunday at 8.30, only on CBS4.